pretty darn cool. The whole lobby is. Okay, I'm in the Silver Chris Lounge in Singapore. And this is shower number so and so, but I want you to. Oh wow, look at that. So as I come in, the light goes on. And a total of 15 rooms. Waterfall shower. After each guest comes in, they have a devoted devoted staff for cleanliness and replenishing all the amenities. You got different toothbrushes and razors and shaving cream and makeup mirrors. Yeah. A sealed towel. Kind of like a hotel maid's cart right here. Fantastic. And here are the guys that keep it clean. Thank you. Hi, yeah, beautiful. Uh, complimentary in business class. Okay, I'm at the far end of the Silver Chris business class lounge in Singapore. This is their $50 million renovation project that just reopened up a couple months ago. So this is the far right end of the lounge. And it's cool how they designed it to look like uh, business class seats, actually, on an airplane. So this particular bar opens up at 5.30. It's more overflow and uh, self-serve beer and sodas. Bloody Mary Station. So this whole bartender service opens up, as I say, about 5.30. That's okay, thanks. And right now it's uh, self-serve. So these are the flights going out. Ours is on time, leaving at another terminal. So this is the entryway. We're up on level level three and come up the escalator. This would be the entrance. That's where I just walked from. And so this is the main area. Alright, enough of that. So this is our flight we're taking right here. San Francisco go to Terminal 1, which is about 20-25 minutes from where we're at, at Terminal 3. Right there are the uh, 15 rooms with uh, showers, devoted staff to clean the showers after each person goes in. This place is 30,000 square feet, so ice machine. Sorted fruit cups. New kind of a, uh, I don't know, power drink. Cereals, kits, salad bars, mini eclairs. Wow. Okay. Uh, different egg sandwiches, and pesto chicken. Almost looks like a grab and go, but. Why are you grabbing food when you're going from here to a business class seating section? I don't understand that. So this here is the famous uh, Singapore dish called laksa. So these are just samples. They do boiling hot noodles right in here. And then steam your shrimp and all that. 
been moving down this section. This is more of an Indian section, believe it or not. But we'll go all the way to the end and then start again. So another bar area. I'm going to show you that beer machine. All self-serve and some really nice wines. Alright, let's check out the food. Then I'll show you where Katie and I are sitting. So here's a couple of soups. Broccoli soup. Uh, was like thinned out cement, but all the other food is uh, top notch. So we got chicken nuggets and fries for the kids. Different dim sums. Black pepper chicken with bell peppers. Uh, seasoned tofu, steamed rice, oven baked penny parmesan. Wow. That looks good after my shower. This is broccoli with garlic coming up. Some noodles. Those smell good, ma'am. And then here, some wadai, a chapati, a sambar. cabbage and mushrooms, and we have uh, vegetarian dumplings, onion piccora, and different donuts, uh, not donuts, they're more savory than anything else. And then over here, coffee service, four-sided station. So we got more additional seating down there. Right now, people are coming in. It is 4.15, and there are no good seats left. All the good seats are taken. So we got here earlier, and I'll show you where we are. We got a couch. What do you got to say, kid? You what? Another leg to go. Another leg to go, I agree. But what are we going to do in the next hour or so? Oh, shower. We are going to shower. Relax, feed up. We got, uh, we've tried all sorts of different little things, but nothing really was wild. I mean, nothing crazy. I didn't try that laxit yet, but. It is too much. So anyway, this is the lounge, Silver Chris, Singapore Airport. 